Hey guys, what's up? So this step I wanna show you, it's so important, it's so freaking important that I decided to just make a video on this step itself. One of the most common things that happens that I didn't know to do for the longest time is, okay, let's say I'm in some deep nested directory. So let's say I'm in CD virtual machines and I'm in CD Ubuntu something. And when I PWD, I'm in some deep directory. But what if I wanted to come back and go to documents, right? What if I wanted to come back out of uh, this directory and out of this other directory and get back into documents or uh, something like that, right? How do I do that? I don't want to have to go back all the way to users. I don't want to do that because that means, or, uh, that means I have to go home. Or even if I want to go to user slash just tastic, like I have to go all the way home and then come back. So what if I want to just step back one directory? So I'll show you guys that really quickly, okay? This trick is really cool. So you can do CD and check this out, dot, dot. That's it, okay? One dot means current directory. So if you do CD dot, you just change into the current directory, which doesn't really make sense. But when you do CD dot dot, you come back one directory. So let me do CD dot dot. And now when I do PWD, I don't even need to do it. You can see that I'm actually uh, in this directory right here and I've come out of this one over here. All right, now if I wanna get to documents, well, what can I do? So if you're watching it, what should I do? CD. Sorry, move the mic a little bit. CD dot dot again, and I'm back to documents. That's it. So if you make a mistake, you do CD Adobe. Well, just do CD dot dot. And I'll teach you a trick. If you're on Linux, you can even do something cooler. So on Windows, you have to do CD dot dot. But if you're on like Linux or Mac or whatever, Ubuntu, uh, you just need to do two dots and it'll take you back. Okay, and don't worry about my terminal because it looks different than your guys's. I have it souped up, I have it pimped out, I have my own setups. I will teach you guys how to do my own setups. However, don't worry about it right now. This has taken me many years to do and learn how to do setups like these and I'll make a course on teaching you guys how to create your own customized setups. For now, just understand how to go back a directory, okay? This is one of the most common commands I use. I'll, I'll go to, again, I'll go to this one and I'll need to come back and I'll just do dot, dot, and I'm right back. This way, feel free to make mistakes, go into any directory you want, hit dot, dot, and come back, okay? Practice it. I want you to stop this video. I want you to go ahead and practice that. Go in as many directories as you can and then just keep coming back one step, two steps, and then go in again and then keep repeating the process. Okay, that's it for this video. You just learned how to go back a directory. We'll learn some more cool things upcoming like removing a file, renaming a file or a folder, things like that. So stay tuned, I'll see you in the next video.